What up, my nigga? Oh, it was good, man. Yeah. Oh, yeah, we yeah, here, B. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Make rounds once again. Yeah, nigga, see me on the last one. Yeah, yeah, we get money together, man. You already know what it is, you know. Good business partners. Mm-hmm. Word. Mm -hmm. It's good though, my nigga. Let's talk about it. Let's talk, man. You know, yeah. I don't know where you want to start, cause man, Dipset names in everybody's mouth right now. I don't know really what's going on. on in oh, I mean, you know, okay. I don't know, man. I guess you know. We took. I mean, we want, this is this is how it went down, man. Me, Cam, Duke, God, a few other Dipset members. We took a uh, flight out to Miami. We spent yeah. the week in Miami for a year. The year came in, we just sat out there, wrote a whole bunch of raps, got our head right and said, fuck, we're gonna come back to the city and be on our bullshit. When we got to the city, we came with it to the uh, studio, and uh, H to the Izzo, V to the Izzo, y'all niggas know the rest, man, y'all heard that first time. <laughs> you know what I mean? So, you know, that's what it is. We ready for war, brother. You heard it? 15 oh. rounds. We ready to go 15. Right. With anybody, I heard it. Yeah, anybody. You gonna punch I'm it talking head. about. So you know, it ain't anything with rock and fella or whatever, whatever. It's, it's with any one of you cocksuckers, nigga. You feel you got problems with the dips. You feel you got problems with me. How? That's so, all I gotta say. My name is pretty easy to say. Al, right? I need all. Is it? Alright, bro. This nigga ain't got nothing to say. Man. So you know, I'll let you know what's on the table. I got the Diplomat 3 album about to come out. You know what I mean? Features everybody from the set. My album for the hell of it. June, July 4th. My nigga JR Writer album. You know what I mean? History the fuck we're making. June 29th. My nigga fucking killer album. Killer season. April 11th. And the motherfucking album. I'm moving. April 11th. So, the album will be dropped on the same fucking And I'm old through the movie. Killer season. Like the 2006 old dog in that motherfucker. Coming out with that double mixtape. Yeah, double mixtape. A lot of changes been made. Coming out with that double mixtape. It's called Hell's Kitchen. But you know, gotta let my nigga Santana do his numbers. You know what I'm saying? Go right now. So, you know, just gonna let him do some more numbers. I don't wanna put my shit out. All his shit is out. You know what I'm saying? Ain't gonna smoke it. So, let my niggas just keep eating BET up, MTV up. Once he die down, all hell break loose. Real quick. So tell us more about your label, man, Hell's Kitchen. Man. Like, Hell's that. Kitchen is a real big fucking movement, man. You know what I'm saying? I don't consider myself a rapper. I consider myself a cook. I know how to cook that coke. I know how to cook up these bars. You know what I'm talking about? So, you know, I'm a motherfucking cook, man. And, uh, you know, the kitchen is my second home. You know what I mean? I wouldn't be in the bedroom too much. You know what I'm saying? I only let some fucking. I don't really sleep too much. So you know, I said, fuck it, I might as well name my label after the second. My second home, the kitchen. I'm always in the kitchen. We gonna eat. Okay. I'm cooking. See, I'm in the kitchen. Yeah, in the kitchen. See, I turned the booth into a kitchen. Okay. You feel what I'm saying? All right. I turned the kitchen. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? From the kitchen to the kitchen. So you know, it's hell's fucking kitchen. Trying to get that mother. A lot of, lot of mother. We trying to, we trying to get stacks of these. Stacks yeah. of mother. I made my nigga Charlie Bucks go here on that week's block compilation. Coming soon. Got his solo project in the making. It's ugly, man. Then I'm putting out the Vultures album, man. You know what I mean? That's like another chapter to the motherfucking Eagles, man. You got the Diplomats. You got the Dipset. You got the Bird Gang. You got the Vultures, man. You know what I mean? So the Vultures tries. So you like having the vultures or like the Yeah, vultures is my clip. Your clip, right. Yeah, you know what I mean? Like Bird Gang is gym. I mean vultures is mine, but it's still all dipset. You know what I'm saying? All dipset. Right, like a JR. Exactly.
Back on top of Hell Kitchen, the vultures. Exactly. Oh, all that's coming under the label and all that. Oh, this is right. all this is future projects are coming. You my nigga, so I'm just letting you know what I got coming. You feel what I'm saying? Yeah. But you know, that's what's basically on the table. Man. You feel me? So when that movie come out, man, niggas is gonna really see a whole lot of shit, man. Like my acting career is gonna really go out the fucking roof, man. Like, you feel me? Scripts is gonna be coming, but I ain't with the acting shit. Unless I got a nice check for me. I find I ain't really with all that acting out of my character shit. Oh, okay, that's what we're playing a good part. Right. Yeah. Nice check. Okay. So everybody, like, a lot of people leaving the industry right now, you know what I'm saying? You think that helps out, you know, the industry or brings it down or you think it's people? It's healthy for hip hop with it's issues that's called creep. You understand what I'm saying? I don't respect a nigga who just sit in his house and say, let me see. I'm gonna write a diss record about this nigga today. Like you playing any, many, many moments, son. You feel me? That shit was corny. Now, if you got a legitimate issue, you understand what I'm saying? Hey, things took place outside of hip hop. You wanna bring it into hip hop? That's cool. You talk about it. That's what you gotta get your mouth for, nigga. You feel me? That's why a nigga can't say that. Cam. Coming at Jay was a publicity stunt because this album's not coming out no time soon. It's coming out in April. You know what I mean? It's not like it's coming out next week or next month or something like that. So it's not a publicity stunt. You know what I'm saying? That was concrete facts. It was raw truth. You know, nigga just said what he had to say. You know what I mean? So don't ever look at us like, don't put us in the category as we, we diss rappers or we, we, we beef rappers. We ain't with none of that sucker shit. And we put it on wax, nigga, that's what it is. We ain't fronting, we ain't stunting, we ain't, we, ain't, we ain't none of that sucker shit, man. We say it on wax, Frank, that's what it is, man. You feel me? So don't ever feel, don't put me in that category, because I ain't with that diss shit, you know what I mean? Nigga say something too slick about me, I'm coming to look for me. I ain't with all that fucking sucker shit, you know what I mean? So, you know, please don't put us in that category, man. We just address issues that need to be dealt with, man. So, you know, that's what that shit is about. Yeah, you're not wrong with that, man. The hardest fucking out, a.k.a. the hungriest out, a.k.a. homeowner, because y'all niggas is still living with mommy, go out and get something. Kind of suck our own property. A lot of shit popping. But right now, this year, I'm not playing with y'all niggas, man. I'm mean, going super duper hard. I officially did my last score in the streets. Know what I mean? I'm done with the streets. I'm full time rapper now. Fuck it, y'all forced me into this shit. So, you know, you did the last score in the streets. Yeah, okay. You know what I mean? So, if you ever see, you ever see, if you ever see, uh, if you ever see Superfly, remember when he said, yeah, make his last score and get out the game? Well, I caught mine, nigga. And, uh, Go hard on you niggas, man. For the hell of it. We'll be in stores July 4th, nigga. Alright? And made these a motherfucking cherry bombs for you cocksuckers, nigga. Alright? Please. Don't get me mixed up with these other rappers, man. I'm doing it for the hell of it. That's the name of the album. Not for the money, because I got that. Not for the fame, because everybody fucking know me. Not for the motherfucking pleasure, because I always get pleased. No homo. So, I'm doing shit for the hell of it. You feel me? Next album, catch me on uh, a label that's cutting me a seven digit check. You know what I mean? I ain't signed on my major label deal yet. That's why That's why you gotta really like, you know why I ain't tooting my own horn, but okay. niggas gotta really like give it up to me, man. I'm well known. I got more money than you motherfucking major label deal niggas, man. Like, y'all niggas got major label deals, man. I'm on couch. How am I popping more than you? How do I got more fans than you? Y'all niggas got major label albums out, man. Hey, you got an album out, for you. Like, I be in the club and, like, mm -hmm. I get shouted out more than niggas that have been in the game five or six years. Mm -hmm. man, what you do out here, man? So, you know, it's like, come on, man. the realness, man. You know, a lot of niggas expecting that bullshit. Word, man. But, uh, you know, I'm making moves, man. And oh, y'all with my niggas making moves, you know what I mean? Oh, yeah. You already know what it is, my nigga Frank is always making moves. He got a lot of shit popping. Feel what I'm saying? That's why I fuck with him. That's why you always see me on anything that's making moves related, my nigga, because I'm definitely making moves. And if you making moves, you need to be watching this shit, man. We motivate niggas, man. Don't be watching this shit just to be looking at it, just to be seeing what niggas is doing, what kind of coat I got on, what kind of chain or type of diamonds is in my watch, man. Fuck all that, man. This is to motivate y'all niggas to start making some moves, man. Exactly. My niggas is making moves, man. We are the everybody, you know what I'm saying? We ought to come up, you know what I'm saying? Dip shit all day, nigga. Holla at me. I mean, what to do? What the fuck the menace is, man?